welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a very special guest. Meet my new puppy, Zoe! Zoe! She hears my brother. <laughs> This is my new puppy, Zoe. We don't know what breed she is yet because she um, was a rescue puppy and they never found out what she was because she was actually in a litter with beagles. So, yeah, right, Zoe? So? Oh. so we did a DNA test um, last week, so actually this week we should be figuring out what she is. On the website it said she was a terrier mix, but then on the papers it said she was a lab mix with a border collie, but she does not look like a border collie at all. She looks like a lab mix with something. We're thinking um, maybe like terrier, lab, Stratfordshire, because if that's how you pronounce it, like um, Pitbull, because this dog actually looks like Zoe, and that's what her dog is. When we first got her, she was probably around like 15 pounds, but now she's 19 pounds. When we first met her though, she was... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> she was um smaller than she is now as you could see in the clips. Okay, so as you could see she's a pretty big puppy I think she looks bigger on camera than she does in real life actually But she is still a little puppy and she's probably gonna be around like 40 50 pounds Um because right now as I said before she's 19 pounds um, Isn't that right? And yeah, ah <laughs> Um, I don't really know what else to say about her besides That she's really cute but I'm just gonna show you like her full body just because that might be interest you guys might be interested. But this is Zoe. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put her back and then I'll tell you guys about her little story. So all my life, um, I was never allowed to get a dog. My dad always told me we were never getting any pets ever. Um I convinced him to get hamsters and then I convinced him to get bunnies. But he never he said never dogs or cats and I've always wanted a dog or a cat but mainly a dog and I just accepted it uh, like a, a year ago or f two years ago that my dad would never let me get a dog until I moved out so when we got our bunny he started getting a little more into animals like liking animals and so I tried convincing him to get a cat but he said no cat um, even though he was at one point kind of thinking about it but ultimately he said no um, three weeks ago maybe, my dad was joking around saying, oh, we might get a dog, like, what if we get a, I don't know, he was saying something about getting a dog, like, joking around, but then later on I was like, dad, like, seriously, do you, would you ever get a dog? He was like, no, like, obviously. I was like, of course. But on Sunday, the, what was the day? My dad, or my parents, called us down and started talking to me and my siblings and said that we are getting a dog. And in that moment, I didn't know how to react because I'm obsessed with dogs and I've always wanted a dog. Um, but I was so shocked because my dad always said he would never get a dog. So that Sunday, we went to visit a dog that my dad saw on a website and fell in love with. She was rescued from North Carolina, I want to say. I'm not totally positive. But we met her um, and we fell in love with her. said that for that whole week we had to wait till that Tuesday that following Tuesday for this volunteer woman to call us and ask about our references and our adoption papers or whatever um, and then she called our references and then that following Thursday we were gonna get a call if we got the puppy and then we would not get a call if we didn't get the puppy and there was tons of other families there looking at Zoe um, so we were really worried and honestly in my mind I really didn't think we were getting her because that following Sunday they were bringing new puppies if um, not everyone got a dog that Sunday. Sorry this is a little confusing. So honestly I was pretty doubtful and not gonna lie I want a small dog but my parents both want like bigger medium sized dogs so it was really their choice since I'll be going to college anyways in two years and then probably moving out after that. So they were really gonna have this dog for the rest of their life or rest of 
next 15 years, whatever. <laughs> we got the call on Tuesday about our references and our adoption papers and then the lady went ahead and called our references. And later that night, we got a call that we got Zoe. And oh my gosh, that was like insane because we were getting a dog and we were supposed to find out that Thursday, but we found out on Tuesday. But that Monday, we had to wait to get her and we weren't sure if we could get her on Sunday, Monday, Saturday. It was just really annoying waiting. So that Monday came. Hey guys, so today is a really special day. I'm in about 30 minutes and leaving to get my new puppy. By the way, if I look a little sweaty, I was just playing basketball with my dad and brother. But I'm about to get my puppy and I'm so excited. Um, I filmed a few clips and I'm sure you saw those before this clip um, when I first met her. But I just want to show you guys real quick my outfit of the day. On top I'm wearing this crop top from Charlotte Russe. This is from Forever 21, leggings from Forever 21, scrunchie from Amazon. Um, also if my mascara is running it's because I'm sweating like crazy. Um, I'm just really excited to see my puppy, and she's so cute. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna quickly get ready. Okay, guys, so I ended up changing my outfit just because I was really sweating, and I feel like white wouldn't be the best um, choice for getting a dog. So I'm just put on this really cute little lemon tank top. This, oh, and this is from Aeropostel. This little gray sweatshirt from I don't even know where. The scrunchies from Amazon, again, just same Forever 21 leggings, and I just took out my hair and just put it in this little braid and I also took off all my makeup so yeah. We were leaving at like 4.30, 4.45 to pick up the puppy and we're supposed to be picking her up at 5 so I'm really excited. So we went to the pet store and we waited and waited and the lady was so late and it was torture because we just wanted our puppy. <laughs> um, I've been waiting my whole life for this moment. So finally the lady came and she didn't have the dog. So then the foster lady came that was fostering the dog while she was waiting to get adopted. She came and brought the dog because she had an AP class or whatever, an AP test, so she couldn't come till a little later. Um, finally, we got our puppy. Um, all she did was like lick and um, just sit there. So we brought her home and we just played. And that home that night I didn't do any of my homework. I kind of just played with my dog. Honestly, like, what are you gonna do? I, I got a new dog. My life, my dreams came true. You know, I just had to play with my dog. So yeah, that is Zoe's little story. Also, she um, well, she's a girl, obviously, um, and. She came with the name Zoe, and honestly, I didn't really want to keep that name because I have a friend named Zoe, and I don't know. But my parents wanted to keep that name, so we kept the name Zoe, which is really cute. So, yeah, that's all about Zoe. If you have any questions, ask them down below. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye! Say bye, puppy! Say bye! <laughs>see that Zoe has hiccups again this is the third time that she's had hiccups since we got her <laughs> and she's just like always having hiccups I don't know why but so there do you have hiccups for the fourth time
when you're not around and I'm feeling down so won't you stay